I just, I want to know if I'm a vampire. I just, I think. I feel like a creature of the night. Who even gets sick in the summer? I mean, I do, because clearly I'm I'm a vampire. And what better to put into your body when you're sick than, than poison? But this is a pina colada, and yes, I do like getting caught in the rain. Also, everyone knows pina coladas have one of your five a day inside of them. The, the rum is the the fruit. So back by popular demand, and by popular demand I mean no one, I'm doing another drunk lesbian watches drunk lesbians watch a lesbian film. It is literally lesbian inception. Also please drink responsibly otherwise I will lick your face. And have I been vaccinated? Who knows? I have never seen this video before, this is my first time watching it, reacting to it, so who knows what treasures await us in this lesbian dragon dwelling dungeon of surprise the film is imagine me and you hello and welcome to drunk lesbians watch today we have with us Brittany ashley she's back you have Third blue eyes your her eyes, eyes match her denim sh good jacket thought it would be no today we're having whiskey gingers <gasps> whiskey ginger is okay, also so one of my favorite drinks movie, imagine me and you the lesbian drink you guys requested it a lot because Imagine Me and You is the only movie lesbians know for some reason because it's so vanilla and non-offensive. Even though it's not non-offensive, I mean Imagine Me and You is literally about a lesbian affair and infidelity. Imagine Me and You. That's hot. Cheers. Thanks. Also Giles. Giles! Oh God! I've never watched Giles be anything but Giles. Who's Giles? I need to Google that. Yeah. So when she cheats, she's married. Sorry, I still can't get over Giles. Oh, Buffy! Oh, this is why lesbians love this movie. I forgot. Making an impression on the family. She's so. Of course, there's gonna be a douchey guy who's going after the lesbian. Oh, totally. I can turn her. Well, I can turn her. Sounds a lot like Ike Turner. From across the room. Wow. Oh, when does that ever happen? Okay, it's happened to me like twice. Yeah. Once. I feel she's unhappy. Let's not talk about that. Look, she seems miserable. She is dead behind those eyes. Wouldn't that be the worst time to like realize that What a mood, dead, dead behind, behind the eyes. When you're fake. I had a Spanish teacher who got left at the altar. She was so fucking mean. Do florists really hang out at weddings this long? I don't know for sure. Oh. Hi. <laughs> Hi. I, I would. I actually want to be a florist and live out my Virginia Woolf fantasies and I would definitely be yeah. hanging around I'd say that's for the like perks. Symbolism? Oh, that is not sanitary. God, I just like can't see him as anything no, it's not. for Buffy's Watcher. He really let himself go after the Watcher's Council. That's body shaving. She's a lesbian, she's got to have tattoos. Uh, yeah. I have tattoos. Oh wow, you're in love. I haven't seen this movie for, for years. She knows a lot of stuff. Most lesbians know a lot about flowers now because of this movie. Like if you ask any lesbian what a lily means, they'll probably know. They're, what are they doing? She's it's not untrue. And I am a plant mom. Mm. Well, it's not a joke, heck. Well done. She's gay. Well done. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, cute. I've eaten worse. There's a joke in there. Joke. Yeah. Ah! I told you I could be in drunk lesbians. I'm fine. I'm just gonna find any way to touch you. Here, take all my coats. <laughs> Here, I'm more I was having crushes on straight women who have boyfriends. That was hell. College was hell. It is hell. Why do you think you grew out of that? But I didn't grow out of it. I didn't grow out of it. I say I grew out of that maybe like four years ago. Wow. Like teach me your ways. Fuck me if I'm wrong, but I think you want to kiss me. You, you and me. It's not gonna happen. There's like so many men though that are exclusively interested in like queer women. Yeah, like, that's like, so true. Men who are like lesbian amorous. It's fucking weird. Perhaps they're afraid to like fully commit themselves to something, so like. Or maybe they just objectify women and can't understand that they're not actually entitled. When we like straight women, I would like two women. That being said, yeah, it's not like I've never crushed on a straight woman, so maybe I should just stop talking. Yeah, but when like men 
like think that they can turn lesbians, it feels like it's baked in misogyny. Mm -hmm. And like not believing that there are some women who like aren't attracted to men. I don't think I've ever believed that I could turn a, a, a woman so much as just like, I hope that she realizes. Pinky to pinky. Oh, the touching is so That was really it's deep. So powerful. Yeah. I had a children's play in front of my salad. Sorry, thinking yeah. about straight women. In I front of my salad. No. <gasps> I can't push it out against my hand. Any reason <gasps> you're right? Maybe if you put them both there. Oh my gosh. That's gay. Okay. You know when you just put your arms around this woman you've never really known for that long? I mean, I do that all the time. And I'm, I didn't even hear what you said. You're a white phenomenon! <laughs> Number nine's like, oh man. <laughs> How many lesbians now go to flower shops and are like, can we just look in the back for a second? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, do you have anything? That's literally why I want to be a florist, just so I can roll around with women in the back on a bed of flowers. That's oh it. no. These are beautiful flowers, do I? Oh, no. See, this is. I mean. Because I just made out with your wife. Yeah. <laughs> because I think I know exactly what's wrong. <laughs> she ran out the window. She ripped out that tiny crack window. <laughs> she ran out the beaded window. How did you find me? The beads, Rachel, the beads. Oh, is this Primrose Hill? I think I filmed... No, I did film Seasons there, but it has no relation. It's a prime lesbian spot. Oh, okay, she thinks <laughs> oh that back tattoo is not a good look. Yes, it is. How dare you? I would lick that back tattoo. It's the most generic tattoos they yeah. put on her because it was like a tribal oh, back she tattoo. She looks too straight. Tribal back tattoo? <laughs> wow, they really nailed all the callbacks. <laughs> Do it, Piper. Do it! You're alive! You're not the nine! Nice. Which is like the perfect way to call out. If you're in a, uh, a like a crowd and you need to find queers. Yeah. So totally. you're like just shouting that. People will be like, what? Yeah, also the cab driver would be like, fuck this. Did, he, did she pay him? <laughs> yeah, I know. Bags, also, like, don't cab drivers like lock their doors? If this is anything like the real world, there'd be some guy being like, oh, you got room for me? That biker just rides by and goes, yeah. hot! We so have a podcast uh, about Daria. It's called Sick or Sadder World. You're and, so gay. Uh, do these videos every week, so come back for some drunk lesbian fun. <laughs> I love drunk lesbian fun. I have not watched that film in in years. It just it feels so like it's from another time to me. You know, I just I had a salad and a pina colada. I am actually a middle-aged white woman. It's it's happened. I'm not mad about it. Salads are great and so are pina coladas. In small quantities, because please drink responsibly. I don't hate Imagine Me and You. I actually really like it. I just it just seems so vanilla, but at the same time it's not vanilla because she's literally having this affair. Anyway, this is not a review of Imagine Me and You, but you know what I mean. Okay guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for instant disappointment and responsible daytime drinking. It is a Saturday. You should know I work Saturdays, but I, I booked it off as holiday. What a great time to be alive. And I'll see you guys next week. Bye.